it's musicology masters, right? That's the one, yeah. And you're doing research or is it taught as well? Uh, it's a bit of both. Okay, okay. So you're going to have a very busy year. <laughs> I think so. This is your fourth year singing in the choir? Yes, I'm about to start a master's, just finished my three-year undergrad and um, have been singing that key for the whole time. I'm going to carry on for another year. Okay, and how have you been enjoying the recording session? Oh gosh, it's been so fun. We were just this last week up on a tour in Yorkshire and we practiced the music a lot, but it was just with a keyboard. And so now being able to do it with an orchestra and also with the soloists is just such a treat. It's a real celebration of all the hard work from last week and just amazing to make music together after a year of being so distanced too. How do you feel that the recording sessions and the music that you're doing fits in with what you do on a weekly basis, normally in term time? I suppose it's both the same and, and different. There's a constant turnover of new music when we're singing here usually and it's obviously in service of the liturgy so it has a more practical purpose in a way but um, it all connects and this is music that um, we've been doing in regular services and I imagine we'll continue to, to sing so it's, it's really wonderful. And you're about to study a master's in theology, In right? theology, oh, yeah. Yes. So carrying on with what I did for my undergrad. It's nice with the choir, it connects a lot with what you're doing with, you know, you're singing. Yesterday we were recording the Creed, we're singing about words that, you know, you study in theology and you think, gosh, this is a life and death word for people in church history and now we're singing about it. So it's theology, I think, connects nicely with what we're, what we're recording this week.